Doing business in China can be of a challenge. And to give you some more insights on how to do business in China, we have here Daphne. And she is a vlogger with a successful e-commerce business in Chengdu, China and in Amsterdam. Daphne, can you uh, tell us what it's like to do business in such a different culture? It's completely different than what I was used to doing business here. Uh, I first went to China about 10 years ago, actually in Hong Kong. Uh, and I really fell in love with the region and the country and I, I really wanted to do business with the Chinese. Uh, but yeah, a lot of it evolves around Guangxi. And what is it, Guangxi? <laughs> well, Guangxi literally means relationships. Uh, but what it means in doing business is that it's all about your network uh, and the personal contact with the people that you do business uh, with. Uh, so, yeah, Western business is more uh, surrounded with contracts, uh, so we want to sign the deal and that means that we're actually in business. Uh, but in China, it's just not that easy and not that straightforward. It's all about uh, putting a lot of time and investing in the personal relationships, uh, having dinner, uh, drinks, alcohol games, karaoke. Uh, it's all part of the networking. All right, all right. And do you as a Dutch girl like this way of networking? <laughs> I actually quite like it. Uh, I can get along in the drinking and the dinner and my uh, Britney Spears on karaoke is quite good. <laughs> I can uh, understand. Do you have uh, advice for young, other young people who want to dive into the Chinese market? Well, I'd say go for it. Uh, it is a completely different ball game, but it can be really rewarding. Uh, and it's just a lot of fun getting to know another culture. Uh, yeah, so just do it. Thanks for sharing your story. Good luck with the business and the karaoke. And for more information, check out our website.